Uh, by the way, when I say the trucker Carson, he is the most bad choice. Is that because he was Indian too? For the guy who said that? I mean, he's a stupid idiot. Maybe I'm against Joe Biden too because he's Indian. I heard, by the way, that he left there in Indiana for two weeks. Do you think this is the reason? Ah, I don't like Joe Biden because he is Indian from Indiana. Did you watch the movie? It's called Indiana Jones. I don't like that movie too. What an idiot. So all those people, we spoke against them. The only one, he is not good for me because he's Indian. So what about the rest of the list? <laughs> I spoke against Trump. I spoke against Obama. I spoke about uh, Harry, uh, uh, Camilla, uh, Harry, her Harrison, whatever her name, you know. <laughs> Carlson, uh, and then this guy is an Indian. Those are not qualified people to be in office. Those are opportunity, men and women. All of them they are potatoes. They ride the wave. They don't have a value. So what is the what is the trend today? The, the trend is what they ride. If the American, the majority of them, they are against supporting Israel, trust me, they will change their opinion overnight. Abdul Potato, this is how they win election. They listen to the trend, what the trend is. Those people have zero ethic. You know what zero ethic is? Zero. And if there is one of them, he have an ethic, he will never become a president. And he will never become important. In order to reach such a place, you have to be a liar. What does that mean? You have to be a politician. You say yes when you should say yes, not because you agree with yes. You say no when you should say no, not because you agree with no. Those are doing politics. And those who do politics, they have zero value. Obama, who is liberal, he supported Hamas in Syria. He supported Hamas in Libya, Muslim Brotherhood. So, how we explain that? How he support Hamas in Syria, he support Hamas in Libya, he support Hamas in Egypt. Why and why he support them? Simply because he's a Muslim. And he supports the Muslim Brotherhood. He is a Muslim Brotherhood. Iran, which is a Shia country, the mullahs of Iran are the founders of the Muslim Brotherhood. Even though that the founder of the Muslim Brotherhood is a Muslim guy, but the first center of the Muslim Brotherhood was built and money paid by Iran. The dream of Obama is to establish Islamic State, and this is exactly what happened. And I say that when he became a president, a few years after ISIS was established. But why Obama he was doing, acting the opposite then, before he was elected? Obama, he go to church, he hold the Bible, he sing the Bible, he go to black African church, he dance with them in the church, he worship Jesus, he care for Jesus. But this is the same guy who was making fun of the Bible just not long time ago. In the time of election, suddenly he became a religious, he's a Christian, even though in the interview he said that I'm a Muslim. Liars. Trump. Lousy women, parties. You name it. They go against him, he go, he hold the Bible in his hand, he go in front of a church, supposedly he is the church protector. But the same Trump, he support organization, they call themselves gays for Trump. Politician. Not value. That is politics. They do anything to win, election 
Not to win ethic. All of them, they have no connection to ethic. And if you think the coming president is going to be an ethical president, well, you must be smart. I mean, we have Nancy Pelosi was in the one in charge of ethic in the Congress for many years. <laughs> She's in charge of two things, ethic and stock market, because they are connected, you know. And Nancy Pelosi, she never bought a stock that did not go crazy as a price. It's a miracle. God, he whispered to her in her ears. He said, listen, buy those stocks next week will go crazy. She buy it, they go crazy. When the stocks will go down, God, he speak to Nancy Pelosi. He sent her answer Zabril. He said to her, listen, the stocks will go down next week. Sell it. She said it. A week after, stocks go down horribly. <sighs> Must be a miracle. Nothing had to do with corruption. Remember, she is the head of the ethic team in the Congress. No way. You know. All of them, they are very ethical. Tucker Carson. He is very ethical. I mean, it's what he do for a living. He speak about ethic. George Soros involved in his Spanish politics. Look, 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 look. Trucker Carson, he want to expose George Soros because he is involved in his Spanish politics. But aren't you doing the same? When you yourself speak about Spanish politics, Aren't you involved in the same? Doesn't matter really like how you do it. <laughs> do, do you know how foolish they are? Do you understand what I'm saying? So if I'm accusing somebody that he should not involve in his Spanish politics, well, what is my business then? I should not me myself prevent myself from speaking about that because I am involving now in his Spanish politics. So what the video will be about will be about the Spanish election. If he's smart, he should change the title. Trucker Carson questioned Mike Pence about being distressed over Ukraine. Why you don't ask somebody he is happy about what's going on in Ukraine? Oh no, Trucker Carson, he like only to hear the opinion of the one who is distressed. Obviously, because he like to hear two sides of the story. <laughs> oh boy, I mean, you know, it's really funny. I mean, you see all those titles. But maybe the best of it is a trucker Carson speaking about trucker Carson himself? The internet was dominated yesterday. Trucker Carson, he said with the condonier, right? Uh, uh, just look at the topic. Look at this, brother. Look at this. Those are serious stuff. We American, we. I mean, you see now the price of gas will go down. Those people like Trucker Carson, Ben Shapiro, uh, you know, uh, uh, you know, they are the one who can know everything. They can answer everything. And, uh, you know, uh, Trucker Carson, he say the effort nonstop all day long. Suddenly he is speaking about disgraceful comment. <laughs> disgraceful what? <laughs> Hilarious. <laughs> Look who's talking. <laughs> Trucker Carson is worried about the response between Ben Shapiro and Candace, 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 her name is Candace. I know what, 
Candace Owens, I don't know how to say her name. What a topic, man, America need that. Thank you, Dr. Carson. I mean, all our life is just around this woman and that idiot. Yeah, both of them are idiot. Uh, Martin Shekhar advised Sam Bankman, fried. I mean, this guy, his name is Bankman, and he became so rich. And then he was afraid and he got bankrupt. Okay, that's good. The name is perfect. Americans are being poisoned and our leaders, that's interesting. What the heck is that? Is that really Trucker Carson page? Doesn't doesn't matter. It doesn't doesn't sound like it. I mean there's nine thousand only. Is that possible? Like is that is that him opening the channel? Trucker Carson, he have 19, 19,000 subscribers only? I don't know what is that. It sounds weird. Anyway. <sighs> you know, at the end of the day, they are businessmen. And you better mind your business and not to be involved with them. They are just there, you know, to fill their time with with money. Their money is their talk. They are useless. They are not journalists. When the last time they struck a carson, you see journalists usually, if they want to involve in politics, they expose uh, corruption. Uh, they investigate, you know, stuff. Those people, they are just talk show. If I am a journalist, I will not be doing what I'm doing now. I will go, let us say I want to investigate uh, an issue, whatever it is. What do people do? How they pick up their topic? In the morning, they check out what is a trend and the trend will be the trend. And you will notice they will invite the most famous for the most famous, support the most famous. Do Trucker Carson invite somebody is poor? Like somebody he cannot afford to make living to explain his life, how hard it is. He never have any interest about those people, no. Who he invite? Billionaires extremely famous rich people why because this is what the crowd like do you remember when in the election of the time of Obama there was a guy his name is Joe the plumber anyone remember Joe the plumber Joe the plumber is a guy he you know uh, you know they stop in the front of his house they ask him a question he, you know and then suddenly the whole debate about Joe the Plumber, the, the election, the presidential election, it turned to be about Joe the Plumber. If you hear what they say in the election, you will hear that they repeated the name of Joe the Plumber like 1,000 times. It was a Joe the Plumber election. 